Hi, my name is Ben Willis. I'm an electrical engineer major, and my role in this team is developing the FPGA application. I'm Daniel Benton, uh, computer science, and I am helping with the electrical parts of the drone. Hello, my name is Connor Harris. I'm a computer science major, and my role is to develop the control systems and also help with the other computer science students on the algorithm, computer vision algorithms that go into this car. Okay. Hello, my name is Scott Hershkowitz. I'm a computer scientist major, and my role is implementing computer vision algorithms for the drone. Hello, my name is Ahmed Dagestani. I'm an electrical engineer, and uh, my job is same as Ben's. We are going to develop the FPGA for the quadcopter. We have just completed our maiden flight of Wadsworth, the curious quadcopter. Unfortunately, Wadsworth suffered some minor injuries to his feet, but no worries, he will soon be fixed. Hopefully at the end of this project, there will be no crashes for Wadsworth to worry about. That is because we are going to develop an application that will fly Wadsworth by himself using computer vision and an FPGA it takes 10 seconds approximately to get warmed up. What it's doing right now is it is reading its gyroscope and accelerometer approximately a thousand times. It's averaging all of those values because this is the quadcopter zero. Zero roll, zero pitch, and zero throttle. throttle. Well, uh, roll, pitch, yaw, zero yaw. So this is at zero, and right about now it's ready to go. As you can see, as I move my pan in different directions, the quadcopter corrects itself. So I'm unable to pitch it very far in any direction or roll it or yaw it. So if I give it a positive pitch, it goes up, negative pitch down, negative, uh, positive roll this direction, negative roll this direction. That's a quadcopter. This is the pink board the development kit that Ahmed and I will be using to develop the FPG application. The computer vision algorithms that the computer science students are using require complex calculations with worst case runtime big O of n cubed. This FPGA will have to be designed to process the images coming through the camera real time in order to make decisions about the quadcopter's next move. The HDMI ports will facilitate the movement of information between the camera and the FPGA. The following is a simple example of the computer vision algorithm that will be developed by the computer science students in this project. The object is to keep the face right in the middle of the square and the vector leading from the center of the square to the center of the individual's face is the displacement that needs to be corrected.